Hey guys, the Animal Wolf Man here with Oleg, and maybe he'll translate a little bit in Russian, that would be cool. I'm going to show you some useful things for wrestling, anti-wrestling, anti-grappling, which is really loose grappling, Sistema solutions to MMA or wrestling problems. Okay? Of course you need to know how to grapple, of course you need to know how to squat. Just like in wrestling, you know many different defenses to the same attack. This is just a different way of doing things. Okay, but it's important to know. I showed how if he gets in on you, how you can manipulate the neck. Now this is if you can anticipate it a little bit earlier. If the guy's coming in here, I can loosely hit him with like a wizard, but not a strong wizard like this. A loose whip and step back. Maybe I rotate him on the ground. He really comes with energy. Like a lot of times you're against the cage. If you get your back stuck against the cage and you get in a shootout, the guy changes levels and comes in. Okay, it's very simple. But instead of throwing a hard wizard, I'm giving a loose whip with my left arm. I'm back lifting with my right, and I'm coming in here. If he doesn't go down to the ground, then I'm going to lose here. Here, and maybe there's a knee to the face or a bad knee to the body. If it stands up, it's still good. And then he's still working on his spins. Okay? There's something rushing the moment. I'm fucking back. Он использует энергию нападающего и расслабленным движением, чтобы не ходить за мозг, просто а, как бы подталкивает твое тело и придает ему вращение. И тогда человек, используя свою энергию, собственно, падает. То есть а, самое главное использовать не жесткий замок, а расслабленное движение, как бы продолжить энергию его тела. So this could be from here, relax, the guy just attacks you. He goes for a sucker clinch, you can just do it, relax, from a hands down stance. Or you, this is a, an MMA, I gave a good example. We get the shootout, we start swinging it, and he comes in. Boom! And then we'll his body, go get him around, here. Okay. One more. Now, if we like attacks a little lower, more lower on the waist. Uh, I can take like a loose punch with my wrist or a cobra punch. Here, I got his arm or his back, I can slap his back with this way down. Then I got a break right here. Okay, again nice and slow because this one's kind of nasty if I get fat. A lot of times a guy will like hit and come down low. So if he comes, I'm gonna touch his arm or his back or something and throw this out to his face and cross him. Okay, the wrist is going to, the thumb is going to die, it goes. As a, as a wrestling cross face, a loose guy. So he comes in, I'm going to slap and cross face That breaks his structure. Oh, four, three, two, and See, I'm trying to rotate him by breaking the structure. I can even add a stomp to the knee if I need it on the same way. Okay, one more time. What's important is to shoot this loose or cross face or cross one punch. And really be met nasty and do the loose and slap his back or his arm to break his posture in a three-dimensional space working against his punch. So there's some simple systemic solutions to an MMA problem. One more. You want to pick up my leg like you're going to take the wrong Okay. If a guy's got a single leg and his head's in, you defend by putting your shin and hopping to the outside, showing wizarding. This, this is all wrestling good stuff. Okay? You can push out and do a jump, uh, jumping knee knockout there. So let's just talk wrestling. If this guy's in the center, then you just keep your forehead and your eyes kind of in the chest. What I can do is as I'm popping with balance and I got my shin here, kickstart defense is also good, that's out and down. Okay, so pressing defenses are good, but here's a looser interpretation of it. I can do a little backhand hit and rotate his head. Sorry about this. In reality, it's really nasty. You can even get away with some wrestling problems. 
Yeah. In a hard wrestling match. He's got a single leg on me. I got my ship outside. I got a wizard in. I'm defending. Maybe he's in a good position with all the finishing signals. Keeping my leg back. I'm popping around DJ Penn's back. I'm going to hit with this hand whatever I can do. At the same time, fall him up and down. So, try to help me to go. Very simple. Loose systema like solutions to MMA and wrestling problems. I'm Dan the Wolfman, go to MMA for self-defense.com. Thank you.